Hi, I'm Trev Hutchings, and this is how to create a professional sounding bus type reverb in BandLab. If you want to create pro sounding reverb, you will need to use a reverb bus. But BandLab doesn't have bus tracks. So here is how to create pro sounding reverb in BandLab. In this project, I have one vocal track. And while I could add reverb to the vocal track, it would not sound very professional in the song mix. So tap on the mixer settings icon at the bottom left of the screen. Then tap on the three dots on the vocal track header. Now tap on duplicate on the pop-up menu. Then tap on the mixer settings icon again. Now double tap on the duplicate vocal track header. And tap on effects at the bottom left of the screen. Then tap on the plus icon. Scroll through the tabs at the top of the screen. and tap on the Reverb tab. Then tap on Space Maker. Next, tap on the text box to the right of the word Mix. Type in 100 and tap on Save. This will make the duplicate track only Reverb without any of the vocals. Now tap on the back arrow at the top left of the screen. Then tap on the X icon at the top right of the screen. Then tap on the mixer settings icon at the bottom left of the screen again. Now tap on the play icon and then drag the dot on the line below the duplicate vocal track's name to the left or the right to adjust the amount of reverb. Set your heart upon the sea Break the chains and set me free Finally, tap on the mixer settings icon at the bottom left of the screen again. Set your heart upon the sea. Break the chains and set me free. In this project, I have six vocal tracks creating a choir. And adding a reverb to each of these tracks will sound terrible in the mix. So tap on the mixer settings icon. Then tap on the S solo icon on all the vocal track headers. Then tap on the mixer settings icon at the bottom left of the screen again. Now tap on the save icon at the top right of the screen. Then tap on save on the pop-up menu. Now tap on the exit icon at the top left of the screen. Then tap on the three dots to the right of the current version. And tap on download on the pop-up menu. Then tap on audio on the pop-up menu.
Now tap on the top half of the screen. Then tap on Studio. Now tap on the plus icon below the bottom track. And click on Import File on the pop-up menu. Now tap on the file we just downloaded. Next, tap on the Mixer Settings icon at the bottom left of the screen. And tap on the S Solo icon. On the vocal tracks. Then tap on the Mixer Settings icon at the bottom left of the screen again. Now double tap on the imported track header and click on effects at the bottom left of the screen. Then tap on the plus icon. Scroll through the tabs at the top of the screen. And tap on the reverb tab. Then tap on Spacemaker. Now tap on the text box to the right of the word mix. Type in 100 and tap on save. This will make the imported track reverb only. Then tap on the back arrow and tap on the X icon at the top right of the screen. Now tap on the Mixer Settings icon at the bottom left of the screen and drag the dot on the line on the imported track header to the left or right to adjust the amount of reverb. Search the heart upon the sea. Chains to set me free. Set your heart on the sea. Break the chains to set me free. Now tap on the mixer settings icon at the bottom left of the screen again. If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.